Okay, Adventure Squad, that was a crazy week. So, I just got out of the hospital, and I got my, have my pick line in, and I have my antibiotics pumping through my body right now. And also, um, so what caused it was I was getting he headaches, because, well, actually it started with um, my ear infection, and then it spread it right here, and it started to give me headaches. Um, so then we went to our doctor, and he told us to get the MRI, and then they did the MRI, and then they saw that there was an infection, so we need to rush to the e and they said that we need to rush to the ER and get IVs done um, for at least a night, and it ended up to be five nights, actually. Um, so yeah. That was pretty crazy. That was my first time ever being like in the hospital in my life, which is good. I want all you guys to know that you can actually have fun and don't be try not try to do your best and be kind to doc to the doctors and then everything will be okay. Magnum. So that's why yes, that's why we have to ask you all these questions whether you have any metals inside of you. And plus your mom and your dad cannot walk in because you still have their stuff on. So I want you to hold this. Which hand is stronger, right one or left one? Right. Yeah, I want you to hold this nice and tight, okay? Remember, this is a big magnet. So I want you to walk slowly towards the center. You could probably use two hands. You want to use the other hand too? In fact, put your hand right here. Okay, I have got it nice and tight. Keep walking slowly. So let's go. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Closer if you want. So let's go. Hold it tight. Got it nice and tight. Both hands. <laughs> you know how hard that's pulling? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Don't give me a chop. <laughs> that's right, pretty cool. Okay. See, that's why we have to make sure everyone's safe to go in here. I have no idea what I'm gonna do because this arm already got an IV in it earlier this morning. So I don't really want another IV in it. But this one, this arm, I'm right-handed and this is my right hand. So it's gonna be hard for me to like to move. So I have no idea. So right now we're at the hospital. It's the same day as I got my MRI. It's just later. And they're gonna give me an IV and it's gonna be in me overnight. And this is, I think where we're gonna sleep. But my mom and my dad are sleeping here and yeah, this is all they have besides this bed. But this bed will only have put me. So, I don't know. And then we're waiting for the nurse to come with my Play-Doh, because she said she would give me Play-Doh, so, so I'm waiting for my Play-Doh. Oh.
she was really nice. So we spent the night at the hospital. It was very fun. But last night, I got a spinal tap, which is, so they took fluids out of my back to test them to see if I had like a virus in my back, but I didn't, which is pretty, which is good. So I only have like a virus right over here, but it spreads up here. It's actually, it's an infection. It's an infection, sorry. Um, and I just got done seeing a fairy, a therapy dog named Piper. Wish I had a, um, so, uh, VR thing. His our friend brought the VR thing and we tried to move the bed. I don't see the door. Oh, how do you go out the door? I can't walk that far. No, hang on. You don't walk. You don't walk. Oh. Okay. Oh. No. No. Here, put your phone. There's a sign in my way right here, though. Put your finger right here. Okay. Do you left? I just can't move. What did you do? Okay. Right there. This guy. This? Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Slap, slap, slap. What are you slapping? A dummy. I'm like an actual dummy, but like a boxing dummy. Bam, 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 bam. That's fine. I'm gonna go upstairs. Go upstairs? I did. You didn't move your feet. I don't need to. I just need to climb up. Well, it's not even stairs, it's a ladder. Uh. I can just get up on here and jump five stories down. What? Is there another bucket? Does he doesn't he already have a bucket on his head? No. You can't open drawers. I need that water. Give me it. Oh, I'm dumping water. No, give me that water. I'm dumping water. Yes. Can I yawn this go? Or I just fell down. Okay, so it's the next morning that we spent two nights in the hospital and we just got back from the teens room, which is a place where there's a video games, air hockey, Pac-Man, a whole bunch of fun stuff. We just got back from there and now I'm just hanging out in, our, in my room and eating some lunch. Why are you still filming me? <laughs> My left ear or right? Right. Oh my God. Here. 
Whoa. Did he drift? Yeah. Oh my god, there's a counter right here, they brought a Wii in my um room so I can play. And so I'm playing a game that tries to guess like my age. So it's not just one game, it's a whole bunch of mini games. We'll have to try to play, um, and it will guess my age at the end. So we'll see how old they think I am. It says I'm 80. That is not true. That's almost... That's like a lot of years off, I have to say. Because I'm only nine. That's. Yeah. We're back in my room from outside, and my mom figured out that there's a whole bunch of buttons on my bed. So now I'm kind of like really tall. Like, I have to jump off. I just got. I just got permission to go outside and my dad brought my dog Cosmo so I can finally see him because I, 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 I haven't seen him for a while so I, I really want to see him so we're at oh. Oh. sorry Cosmo was barking at someone um, but what I, was, what I was saying I got rudely interrupted by someone um, that we're at the Rose Garden, um, where my, but right by my hospital. The hospital owns it. So I just came here to see my dog Cosmo, and I finally get out, go outside. It's just the longest it's ever been since I've gone outside. Like the longest I've ever gone without going outside. Which is pretty crazy. Because you usually go outside every single day. Well, yeah. Like, I kind of have to. Well, not have to, but like. I usually go somewhere or go in my backyard. Cause basically every day I go outside is what I'm trying to say. So yeah, I'll see you when we get back in.
both up with water and then I have this one that's filled with air and this other one is filled with more air I just filled this one up and now it's a wet glove it's actually a fun fidget though Michael what's going on uh, give me sleep medicine I gave you sleep medicine what's this is how Micah eats saltines now. We're trying crackers after clear liquids. His arms are cold, so he's eating like this. Good job. <laughs> how you feeling? Tired. Tired. All right, you can sleep as much as you want. Also, there's lots of fun things you can do, at least at my hospital there was. There's probably some at your hospital, too. And make sure to like and subscribe for more adventures.